The newsmakers are on Power 102 every morning with Richard, Wendell, Rhoda and Steve. On the Power Breakfast Show today, the Commissioner of Police, Mr. Gary Griffith. Gary Griffith is in studio. Mm-hmm. Uh, Commissioner Griffith, so we, 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 we paused there where you're talking about pausing and reflecting with res- respect to beyond the tape. Now, police officers are, are employed by the state. The state is essentially, you know, us people, the, the, the citizens of Trinidad and Tobago. So if we want them back on... On, on television, what you know, what's going to happen there? Is there an impasse? Yeah, of course. And uh, this is not a case of a boycott. This is a case of just it's difficult. For, I'm not going to order a police officer, but the same police officers who usually go on had a serious issue by the, by the way and the bias uh, of of how it is persons were and the, and basically it is one individual. So all that they're saying is, listen, you need to temper yourself. You need to and then the, that's the problem with the media. At no time has, the media has always certain persons in the media feel that it's, it is our right to criticize, to to attack you, to see what we want about you. But if we speak about you, you're runners at a cry to mat. And this is not the, the mat. The job of mat is not to see about media associate media officials alone. You need to look at the bigger picture. We go back to the raids. Three daily newspapers said it was a raid. No one, not one of the media houses, contacted the police. You were wrong. Oh my God! So then, what just was admit it? Admit when it is you make a mistake. What but was it then, Commissioner? It was a it was a search that was conducted. A raid is something forced entry. You kick down doors. Pe- the people opened the door. They la- they had this. They were seated for twenty minutes. They gave them coffee. You never saw Satmarad smile so much in your life. But I was a read. You were wrong. You made a mistake. And the reason they did it is because they automatic. And then the Matt um, Matt Vice President says, "Well, our job is not to investigate." Well, that's where you're wrong. Your job you must do some in the, the type of investigative reporting. You can't just take one side of the story and print. The man, you were wrong. You failed. And, and that is what happened. You make a mistake. All that I had to do was to defend my police officers. And I'm not saying that the police may not have also made a mistake. Unlike Matt, I am open-minded. Because Ma- they, Matt just listened to the views of the two persons. Because the person said no warrant was issued. But then they started explaining the flaws in the warrant. If you know the flaws in the warrant, how come you didn't get it? Then they said it was a raid. But they were, but they were allowed entry. Then they said that that we were very hostile. But Satmaraj is seen laughing. It doesn't mean that there may be officers who may have been unprofessional or aggressive between the entrance and Mr. Maraj uh, meeting and whatever. But up to now, something that is so serious, up to now, Matt, Sat, Hat, Rat, nobody has written to me. Can we see the warrant? Is it possible for the warrant to be to, to be made public? No, or I'm, that, I'm, that's just something. Yeah, yeah. I'm just wondering. I was, <laughs> I was, I was just unusual. wondering. I was just <laughs> wondering. Very unusual. But the warrant I'm concerned about was the warrant to search Buju Bantan's hotel. What was that about? Because what was the grounds yeah. for searching Buju right, Bantan's again, hotel room? The, the system, there's a system through intelligence agencies that are external to the police service and internal that true intelligence inf- uh, it can be fed to the OCIU and other agencies but before it is you do an operation um, to you you need to do proper surveillance because you can't just based on intelligence just keep rushing in therein lies the problem there were there were shortcomings and we dropped the ball and I so what was the intelligence that Buju had a joint that they, that drugs that drugs were in in the room like uh, like herb like substances yes plant like plant like substances. substances you know I was at his concert and there was a lot of plant like substances in the crowd where was the warrant for that no you know strange enough that's 25,000 people you hardly smell that. I, I thought that there would be more people smoking than not smoking. It was a very decent So crowd. did you arrest oh. people for smoking in the crowd that evening? Because I saw you. Did any police <laughs> officer arrest anybody? In the no, crowd? no, it was incident free. The only incident was when I went on stage. So there were no... <laughs> so there <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and that was that. an incident. Especially with the singing. I was right. about to... But, but is it but concerning? You know, in, a, in a nutshell, what uh-huh. I could say, though, it, with, with the, whole, the whole matter that happened, I will quote it here, taking a line from Buju's song. We should have never searched Buju. <laughs> <laughs> but isn't it concerning to you that an, a, a high-profile person can come into this country under the circumstances that he did and that a warrant could be issued on a Saturday by, I would imagine, a magistrate to search this gentleman and not and the commissioner of police not know? No, no, I, I was aware. Mm. I was aware. And again, this way it, is, it put me in a very difficult position because there's intelligence, and I said, but you have to have, you mu- there must be surveillance. So when it, and once it was squ- very strange, it was sent directly to me. Usually these things will not be sent to me. But all of a sudden, it was coincidentally, they just decided to send it to me. Mm-hmm. This was sent to me. Now, guess what happened? If, had I not, if I decided to say, do not go in there, the next thing you'd have seen is somebody would have sent a message and said dereliction of duty. The commissioner mm. of police got intelligence and refused to act. So this thing, 
I'm not saying it was. Yeah, a, I know how that I'm not looks. saying it was a mm. setup, mm. but it was. There's a lot of murky waters inside there. How this thing went down, and and but at the end of the day, a mis- a big mistake was made by other individuals. I am not one to shirk my responsibility. I didn't have to. I could have just. Oh, what was I could the mistake? Just, um, threw them on. Because you got intelligence and you didn't do proper surveillance to verify the intelligence. Because okay. intelligence is not one that every time there's intelligence to say that Richard's involved in something, it gives a right to just put a warrant to go into your house. Yeah. So before intelligence, after the intelligence, you must do proper surveillance to, to give enough grounds to substantiate the warrant. That was not done. So it means that there was a major flaw. But by the intelligence being brought to me, quite coincidentally, it meant that had I decided to say, let us not do it, somebody could have very well gone to the media to say the commissioner, even though he got intelligence, he refused to do so. So, commissioner, the restructuring that you're planning to do within the police service, is it likely to, to erase things like that taking place? Nothing will be e- eliminated, but it will greatly reduce the, these, these shortcomings. It will also greatly improve the intelligence units. So, what's the nature of the restructuring? Okay, and, and again, let me say, this is not in any way targeted at individuals in the OCIU. There are, there, there are hundreds of officers there in the OCIU. And I'll give you a simple example. We have 7,000 police officers. 136 is in the OCIU. Intelligence is the primary function for good policing. So you're talking about 100 and something officers to, to, to and then you have 6,000 plus officers doing operations. So basically they are doing operations blindly without without proper intelligence feed being given. Feed in the yeah. So the intelligence, it, 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 we have dropped the ball. We have, we, have, we have used an intelligence structure that is outdated, which is why it is being restructured. And so, so it is a central intelligence bureau. It will have under that headquarters uh, uh, legal arm and analysts. But then there will be five subunits. One subunit dealing specifically with drugs. One dealing specifically with fi- illegal firearms. One dealing with daily intelligence. This is Power 102, empowering you.